Hello and welcome back to ITSM 101. This week we continue our video series on enterprise service management as we dive even deeper into what it entails. So there's no doubt that enterprise service management is becoming more popular, but what's driving the increased adoption? Personally, I think there are four main drivers. The first is consumerization, with the impact of consumer world experiences on employee expectations not only affecting the corporate IT organization, it's affecting all corporate service providers as these astute consumers of business services are now so conditioned in their personal lives to expect convenience, fast service and the ability to find whatever they need whenever they need it that they now expect this at work, whether it be from IT or any other corporate service provider. Then there's the demand for enterprise service management capabilities from other corporate service providers. So this is HR saying pull rather than IT push, with enterprise service management seen as a way to help increase operational efficiency and to improve service. It's a totally different dynamic to the early enterprise service management adoption scenarios where the corporate IT organisation sought other uses for its ITSM tool to garner a better return on its technology investment. Thirdly, ITSM solutions are now so much better and more applicable to non-IT use cases. There are additional capabilities such as self-service and service catalogues, internally and externally facing knowledge bases with the latter great for employee self-help, chat capabilities and mobile apps. Plus the solutions are now far more flexible, i.e. easier to change, and more accommodating of multi-departmental use. Finally, there's increased ITSM tool vendor marketing of enterprise service management. Vendors have moved from merely reacting to demand to actively promoting and selling their enterprise service management capabilities along with those for ITSM. Whereas opportunities might have previously started with a need for a help desk tool and blossomed into a wider ITSM opportunity, now they might blossom into an enterprise service management opportunity. In many ways, we're in a perfect storm as business function needs, employee expectations and technology advancements meet to create the opportunity for enterprise service management. Finally, if you have a burning question about enterprise service management or ITSM per se, please leave it in the comments section and I'll try to answer it in future videos. Please subscribe to stay updated and I'll see you again next week. Goodbye. So, when selling enterprise service management to other business functions, it shouldn't need to be a leap of faith by either the business as a whole